Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's um, Jill with At Home with Jill. And um, today is... I'm organizing my clothes. <laughs> today is Monday. And even though we have a whole school day ahead of us, um, Mondays are for weekly home blessings with the Fly Lady system. And so I'm going to take you guys through that today. Um, so... The weekly home blessing is basically a way to clean your house um, once a week so that, you know, like your floors get clean and stuff like that. Um, so what you should focus on on Mondays for the weekly home blessing is changing the sheets, emptying all the trash cans, um, cleaning cleaning mirrors, all the mirrors, dusting, vacuuming, and mopping. I'm gonna change my sheets, mine, I'm gonna wash my sheets, and then um, I'll probably empty all the trash, and then I think we'll start school. And while my kids are doing something where they don't like need me, um, I think I will go through and do all the mirrors, check that off, and then again, um, another time that they are doing something where they don't need me, um, I will go around and dust as many surfaces as I can, and then I think I will like finish school, and then once, oh, and during all this, during school, when my sheets are done, I'm gonna put in someone else's sheets. And when those sheets are done, I'm gonna put in someone else's. So all day, I'm gonna have sheets washing. Um, so I can get the whole family's sheets washed today. And then um, after school, like before I start making dinner and all of that, I think I will vacuum and mop. And I'm not gonna like, put pressure on myself. So if I don't get to the vacuuming and mopping before making dinner and stuff, I'll do that after dinner or something. I don't know, I'll figure it out. But I am i don't put pressure on myself to get these things done. And if I don't even get to mop today, I'll mop tomorrow morning. Like, I make this work for us in a way that it doesn't stress me out. So if it's gonna stress me out, to try to get everything done today, then I won't get everything done today. That's, it's that simple. Um, these routines are not meant to stress you out. So, yeah. And then my daily routine, so like what else I have to do today is just the simple daily things, like um, dishes, which happen daily. Um, I'm gonna get dressed and well, I'm not gonna make my bed until my sheets are done. Um, and then just work on a hot spot for two minutes. That means a cluttered area in my house, I will straighten out for two minutes and that's it. And then um, wiping down a bathroom, counter and toilet, and that's it, okay? That's it. Whoa. So it's that simple. And then, um, yeah, that's it. So. It's really not that much work, you guys. I know it sounds like a lot when I'm like listing things off, but it's seriously not that much time out of your day um, to get these things done. And it has been so life-changing for me doing these routines. Um, it's actually helped me to like procrastinate less in different areas of my life too, um, which is, has been pretty awesome so so yeah i'm gonna get on into this video i probably rambled way too much already so when i do my weekly home blessing i always start with taking my sheets off um since laundry washes you know, while you do other things, it just makes sense to always have a load going. It's kind of like passive, you know, it's just happening while you're not doing anything. So it just makes sense. 
Okay, I just wanted to add that I don't always wash my comforter and duvet cover. Um, I normally wash those like every couple weeks or every month sometimes. It just depends on if I think it's dirty or not. Um, usually I'm just washing the sheets and then, yeah. So this is all laundry that I folded the night before um, when everyone was sleeping so I wasn't able to put it away. So I'm just starting out by putting all that away and then I had another load sitting in the laundry basket waiting to be folded so I got that done too. Um, and this is like a random load where I just went around the house and grabbed clothes that were like maybe on the living room floor, on the bathroom floors, um, just in the bedrooms, like just random clothes that were not put in a laundry basket and it actually made an entire load when I did that. Think about me, or are you busy with someone else? You and I, we got our differences. Wow, I am really hoping that I was done with my coffee, um, since apparently my cat seemed to be enjoying some of it. Second set of bedding is going in and I stopped um, filming me doing all the bedding after this so I think that's the last thing you're going to see of the washer and dryer. Um, and then here I'm just unloading the dishwasher from the day before so that I can um, have a clean empty dishwasher for today's dishes. And again, this is just part of my daily routine. So this is not part of the weekly home blessing. And um, you can see I have frozen chicken on the counter there. That is also part of my morning routine is to make sure I have something planned for dinner so that I am not stressing out later when everyone's getting hungry and it's getting dinner time. I've done laundry, dishes, I've got ready, I've planned dinner. Um, I'm in the process of doing the sheets. I'm not gonna mark it off until I have the last set done. Um, I'm gonna go around right now and empty all the trash cans. Okay, and then this is what I planned for dinner. I erase this every day and write um, the next one. And then, um, Every day I erase this. Also, this is so that I fill up my 32 ounce um, cup of water four times. Also, this week's zone is bathrooms. Might not start on this today, just because today is the weekly home blessing, but tomorrow I'll probably start um, on my zone, which is bathrooms and then laundry room. But I don't have a laundry room, I have a closet. So yeah, all right. Something I started doing a couple years ago um, to save time while making my bed is I do not try to stuff the comforter inside the duvet cover anymore. I just put the comforter on and then I just put the duvet cover right on top. Um, 
and it makes it that much easier. Um, I The kind that I have doesn't have the ties in the corners that makes it easy and it was such a pain but I was literally getting inside of it every day. I mean not every day but every time I washed it and I just could not do that anymore. I was so over it. All right, so now I am moving on to cleaning all of the mirrors in the house, and I'm starting in this front bathroom. You guys, this bathroom needs so much work, it's crazy. Um, I don't know when we'll get to it, but hopefully soon. And then here I am in the girls' room, and this is their little you know, mirror that they use when they get dressed, and bathroom. You guys, I am so ready for all of the construction to be done with. I'm so over it. Um, I'm just, I want everything to be done so that I can get my house in order and have it stay that way. The storm. I'm starting to believe you can. Cause baby, you the remedy. You're my mirror, I can finally see you bringing out the best in me, yeah. I don't want these problems, I know I got a lot of work to do. Okay, so now that I am moving on to dusting, I just wanted to say that my house was actually super messy and I had to like clear off all the surfaces before I could even dust. Um, I did this off camera like ahead of time. I had to clean everything up off of the floor and everything in order to mop and vacuum and it was just crazy. Like over here in this corner right now is my all the stuff, ugh, all the stuff that my son packed when we evacuated and it's just all sitting there because um, his room is filled with the girls' mattresses. So, yeah, like I said, I'm just ready for everything to go back to normal. Okay, so now that I'm vacuuming, I know it's getting close to the end, and I just wanted to say, you guys, this did not take me all day. Um, so when I put all the footage in my program to start editing, it was an hour's worth of footage, and I even had more than just the weekly home blessing on this footage. Like I showed you guys like emptying the dishwasher and folding laundry and all of that. So the weekly home blessing itself doesn't even take an hour out of your entire day. So like I said, I know it looks like a lot, but really it is not a lot, you guys. I promise it's one hour out of your entire week and it just makes you feel so accomplished once it's done. Um, and yeah, that's pile right there at the foot of my bed. That is from my office and that is in a separate video that I've been working on. So um, I'm actually, I think I'm finished with that. I already got all of that stuff taken care of and so that's gonna be in another video coming up shortly. I'm showing you guys a close-up of my kitchen floors just because I know a lot of times um, when the camera's far away it looks like I'm just cleaning something that's already clean but I just wanted to show you guys like no my kitchen floor gets so filthy and see now that the camera's far away you can hardly even tell how dirty it was so that's why I wanted to give you guys a close-up Don't 
just after three o'clock it's about 3 15 and I'm completely done with my weekly home blessing um, I've pretty much done my entire morning routine so I did not do the bathroom um, swish and swipe because my zone this week is actually bathrooms so I'm gonna be working on my bathrooms like starting tomorrow and through the week um, so yeah so I didn't do that and then um, the only other one was that I didn't do was um, two minute hotspot. And actually, I'm just gonna call it good on that because um, what I didn't show on camera today because this video was only about my weekly home blessing. Um, so what I didn't show was I actually did a lot of decluttering um, in my room and in the kitchen and in the living room. And so I was decluttering today, so I'm gonna just check off my two minute hotspot anyway. And yeah, um, I guess that's it, I don't know. I just wanted to let you guys know like, all you're seeing in this video is me cleaning and doing the home blessing stuff but that's not all I did today like I it did not take me hours and hours and hours to do this stuff it's it's a quick thing here and there and then I'm doing other stuff in between um, I didn't ever do school with my kids because I remembered that we're actually going on vacation later this week a little mini vacation and I didn't so I didn't want to like start the school week and then not finish it. So we're just going to take the whole week off. Um, beauty of homeschooling. But um, yeah, so we're just going to take this week off. So I had the kids watching like Wild Kratts, which is like an educational show. And we watched some Anne of Green Gables. Um, yeah. We love that. Um, not Anne with an E, the newer one. It's the old school one that we watched. Um... And then and we watch the wildcats, and the wildcats teach teach real stuff about animals. Yeah, I already said. So I I didn't film. I just didn't film my whole day. So what you guys see is just me cleaning all day. But I didn't like. I relaxed a lot today. I'm pretty tired. Um, we were out late last night, so. I did a lot of relaxing. I did a lot of cleaning up in my room. Excuse me, Briella. You're putting... Also, uh, my little ones like seemed to get hurt about 50 million times today. And they just kept needing me. And... Yeah. So, like... On YouTube is not always the whole real thing, okay? So, it was actually hard to get all my mopping done because... I had two kids get hurt during my mopping time, and yeah, so that's just how it is. Anyway, my last um, set of sheets are in the dryer, so all I have to do is put the girls' sheets on, and then when Cade's come out of the dryer, I'll put his on, and then that's it. Um, I got them all washed, so that's nice. And... And... Oh. I got dinner in the crock pot, slow cooking some chicken, and then Baby. I'm Hi. I'm slow cooking chicken, and then I'm gonna make some rice. We're gonna have chicken fried rice um, tonight, and yeah, I guess that's all I have to say right now. Um, thank you guys for watching. I I don't know if this maybe inspired you or if it didn't, but if you 
are interested in the fly lady system i will link the book down below and come here i'll link the book down below and i will also um link where i get those printable um sheets from that i mark off okay so, so yeah i have a baby and then a bunny and then a baby. Where's your glasses? <laughs> and then a bottle. No, don't Where are your glasses? Box. Where's your new glasses? Uh, I'll go get them. Kitty, kitty. Kitty, kitty. Kitty, kitty. Kitty, kitty. Hey, 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 hey. Oh my gosh. She's attacking the basket of cords. Got them. So I gave Briella my old um, prescription glasses and I just popped the lenses out and gave them to her. And look, they have pink and black polka dots. Then inside it's pure pink. They probably didn't even hear you because you said that so quiet. Mm. So, it's black and pink polka dots. And then... And then... Pure pink on the inside. You're still talking really quiet. <laughs> okay. All right. So thanks for watching, guys. Um, if you liked today's video, please give me a thumbs up. If you like my channel, subscribe. And we will see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Bye.